So, I'm gonna do a bubble mask because this shit looks crazy. Like I've seen it on the interwebs, on the YouTubes, and it's always hilarious to watch. So I was like, I wanna try it. And I figure why not share the ridiculousness with you because, you know, I like to make an ass out of myself on the interwebs sometimes. But anyways, this is it. This is the, it's backwards. It's because I'm using the front facing camera. But you get the idea. Anyways, I'll put it in the description. So, woo, comes with an applicator. I know I'm not getting paid to do this. Like I bought it myself on Amazon. I'm just dumb. And I just want to, I just want to be dumb. And see what happens when the bubble, like I want you guys to witness me witnessing the bubbling for the first time. I'm talking a lot. I talk a lot. I'm a talker. So here we go. I'm not going to read the directions because I don't do that. I don't read directions. We're just, this is what it looks like. We're just going to get on in there and do this. We don't need directions. We're just going to smack the, slap it on. Okay. So like, I have no idea if I'm putting on too much or too little, but I have a feeling I probably ought to do this relatively quickly before the full bubbling happens. Do you supposed to put it on your nose? I don't know. I didn't read the directions. We're just gonna do it. It feels good. It doesn't smell like too much of anything. <laughs> I should have done this live, but I was kind of worried only like five people would watch it and it would hurt my feelings. So I was like, fuck that. Am I pretty yet? No. Oh, I think something's already starting to happen. I feel like I should be putting a whole lot of this shit on here. Cause I want to look like full on bubble face crazy. I don't want to half ass the bubbling. So while it does say like milky piggy, I checked the ingredients. There's no actual milk in there and there's definitely not pigs. Um, and they don't test on animals in Korea. It's cruelty free. All right. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna get closer. But yeah, do you like my Johnny Cash shirt? I got it at Target because I'm fancy. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Eh. No wasting. I'm also cheap. Get on there. Do-do-do-do. Ah! So, we wait. I'm probably gonna have to cut or do some kind of editing shit while this waits because you don't want to see all this. Let's see. It's starting to bubble. Doom, 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 doom. I'm gonna, I'll be back. I'll be back. Pausing. Oh, it's starting to bubble up more. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's getting there. Look at my, arr, the fangs. I have bad teeth. I don't care. Fuck it. It's happening. Ooh. I'm going to pause it.
I'll be back. It's still bumbling. Some of it's getting really high. So I'm going to leave it on for a little bit. And I'm going to tell you a story. Because why is this story time? Plus, it might be fun to watch this. Anyways, okay. So I'll tell you an embarrassing story. So I was uh, like many kids of the 80s. We like lived at the roller rink. And of course, this guy that I had a major crush on, his name, should I say his name? Eh, fuck it. His name was Steve. I had a huge crush on him, big time, like major crush. And he was at the roller rink and I was like, oh, oh my God, oh my God, woo, he's, he's here. And so I'm like, I'm going to do some tricks. I'm going to skate backwards. I'm going to do the spin shit. We're going to whip around like your friends hold hands and you, this is really like, yeah, <laughs> so, and you know, all the cool things. And then I'm like, yeah, I wonder if he's looking. So of course, like right as I was going and skating beside him, I go to bust my ass. Now I am doing everything to keep from busting my ass. I'm like, Ugh! it's like Matrix style shit. I'm like fucking everything I could do to keep from falling. I'm like, Ugh! twisting, contorting. Like, it, <laughs> this is looking ridiculous. Oh shit. Man down. Man down. I lost the bubble. Oh. Anyways. I'm contorting. I'm flailing. And I'm like, fuck. Maybe he didn't see. Maybe he didn't see. He was talking to his friend. Like, he didn't see any of that. So, like, okay. Went back to skating, doing my thing. And then it's time. It's closing. It's time to leave. And he comes up to me. And he's like, I saw you out there skating. And I was like, hmm, you did? Oh my God, I didn't realize that you were watching me. <laughs> and he was like, you know, you looked a lot more stupid trying to keep from falling than if you didn't just let yourself fall. Yeah, that happened. <laughs> this is hilarious. Anyways, I feel like that's like some kind of metaphor for life. To just like let yourself fall or you look dumb when you try to fall in a futile situation i don't know like i'm a you know i'm a survivor i'm not gonna just let myself fall i have to think about it i guess it depends on the situation anyways this looks ridiculous i don't know if it's gonna get any bigger <laughs> i'm gonna pause it for a little while I'll be back if it gets bigger. I'll let you know. <laughs> so, I think we've reached full bubbleage. I don't, I look like some kind of really fucked up cartoon character. I don't even know. Kind of reminds me of like that spray on uh, foamy insulation stuff i don't know it feels kind of neat <laughs> but look, look look at this <laughs> there you go bubble mask happy vd y'all bye bye